<clears throat> Hello, Teenage America. I am the Rabble Rouser, and we are back with more never-ending nightmares. When we last left off, we pulled the vein out of our arm and woke up. So we're gonna take this axe. Uh... Cut some lumber? When? What is this? Alright, so... We still brushing our teeth too hard? Yes, we are. All right. Man, you need to learn how to run f longer. Because, man, you are not in shape. All right, so we got a picture of a bird. Some ham, a skull with wine, a ham again. The hell is with all these paintings? A food. There's one happy looking girl. A bird again. I have a feeling that these are all being repeated. The room is getting darker behind me. Looks like we have some sentient darkness. Alright. This is one rather long hallway. There we go. Up. Oh. Sure, you can cut a board in, or two boards in half with one swing of an axe, but you can run for more than I don't know, ten seconds. You need to get your priorities straight, man. Upper body strength isn't where it's all at. All right, so it looks like we're in the attic, and um. Your sister hung herself. Hey, sis. We'll just cut you down. Oh, you're still alive. Yeah, we'll just cut you down and everything should be gravy. Alright. Notice that there's cobwebs. The uh, wallpaper's being ripped. So it's a little bit more deteriorated. I still can't go into the closet. But let's go outside of the room. Yep. Apparently the maid's been out of town for a while. Or I'm just a lazy bastard and don't clean anything. Alright, some more toy soldiers. Oh yeah, and the blocks that say possibly murder. Alright, so here's a bathroom. With some dolls. There's a little bit, few bit of cracks in that, uh, uh, porcelain face. Alright, next, next room. Alright. So we're gonna go up here. Which apparently we are going down for some reason. If that makes sense. Oh, there is a cabinet. Let's check this bitch out. Fascinating. Alright, I guess we're gonna go into this door next. Open. There we go. Nothing interesting in here? There is not. Fantastic. Let's keep going. I don't recall if we need a light down here or not. We can find out. All right. Going down, down, down. The flames went high. Nope. Don't need a light. We are progressing. My commentary is exciting. Alright, we're in another room with more dolls. Nothing to interact with, I'm guessing, except for the other door. Alright, there's a nun doll, and more dolls, and holy crap. 
There's such a thing as having a bit too many dolls there, man. I mean, she's your sister, and your parents really need to, you know... I mean, if the dolls are gonna end up cracked like this one's eye, then why... Uh, I don't know. I live in an area where you take care of your toys, damn it. But those were different times. Oh, Now that looks like a girl that actually, you know, isn't angry at the world. That's a nice picture. Alright. We'll check out this room, then we'll check out the hallway. Oh, there's the angry girl again. There's nothing in here again. I just have the compulsive need to uh, look in every room. Did it get darker? Alright. We'll keep going. Keep going. Are we gonna go to Narnia in this one? Apparently, yes, we are. There's some big baby demon thing. That is. One ugly looking son of a gun. Oh gosh. Well, there's our first uh, adversary. And we have defeated him by hiding. Honestly, I'm not surprised that this is how this guy defeats his foes, is by running and hiding. <coughs> then again, the average human being would probably be the same way when it comes to ugly baby monsters. Alright, we'll check out this room. Oh, I was gonna... I was assuming you were gonna look exactly like the other one did. But no. Right. Next room. Well, let's continue down the hallway. Alright, we got a bird. Portrait, more dolls. Wow, this is very boring commentary because it's all about commenting on the pictures and the fact there are dolls. These ones are in cages. Why? I don't know. So, let's keep going, I guess. Alright, another cabinet. We're gonna have a baby monster come after us again, or walk past us, I should say. Waiting, 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 impatient. Yep, more cobwebs, dolls, and weird paintings. Yep, this isn't too exciting. Maybe we need to go through this one. We'll just wait a bit. And impatient. Besides, there's the hallway right there. Alright, down the hall we go. Alright, check out this room. More dolls. This one's different. More cobwebs. Painting of a ham again. I really like their hams here, I guess. Honestly, right now, you're not really getting to me. I mean, you got that baby monster. That thing was pretty creepy. But, you know, besides that, it's just walking into the rooms with dolls and weird paintings and then walking out of them. Oh, here's another room. Let's see. Dolls. More dolls. Wait a minute, did that... Alright, that portrait didn't have color on it, so I couldn't examine it. Alright, let's go farther. I don't know what it means if I go through these doors, because I was told that there are multiple endings. I don't know if going through and seeing everything is a bad thing. Ooh. Oh, big baby man's after me. 
in the door. Whew. I'm surprised I survived that. And he's after me. There you go. There's some tension right there. Okay. We got a like wood here. We can cross it. Oh. I guess we can't cross that. So, we're in another room with more dolls. After waking up. I suppose this is why it's called Never Ending Nightmares, because you're constantly waking up when you quote unquote die. Aw, oh, that one's happy and can blink. That's interesting. Alright. Next hallway. Alright. Hang on here in case Baby Man comes by. Damn it, baby man! You were supposed to come earlier. Hopefully, you didn't see me. You did not. Goodbye, baby. Oh, fuck me! I'm gonna die. Hi. Ooh. So that was our first death. Creepy motherfucker. All right. So I don't know if that carried over when I looked at this doll, but I'm assuming that it does matter, so look at it. It's not blinking at me again, so. Well, big baby man just wanted to give me a hug. A hug that crushed all my organs. So, we're going to sit in this cabinet and wait for what we know is the baby monster coming by and get away from him. Come on. God, you're creepy looking. Oh. You're smelling to see if you made an accident in your diaper? Alright, don't go... Don't get too close. Alright, so I'm guessing he is going to turn back around and go the other way soon. Lest they give me this cabinet for no reason. Okay, come on. Maybe we could have continued following him, but I do not want to make that chance, or take that chance. Excuse me. Yeah, yeah, your diaper's still good. Hi, baby monster. Now let's get the hell out of here. Because that thing is creepy as all hell looking. Alright. Yeah, we could have gone on. But we really don't need to. Well, we could have hidden in that cabinet there, but we really didn't mean to need to. So there's a candle lit there, but we don't need it. Holy criminy. Hoping that he isn't. Fuck! Get in, get in, get in! Oh, good, they're stupid. I hope they're stupid. Yep. Oh, I was gonna say not taking chances even if there are more cabinets. Yeah, your diaper's good too. Keep going, baby monster. Honestly, I never thought I'd use that word a lot, baby monster. Or honestly at all. Alright, so it looks like we're finally going upstairs. I think this is the first time going upstairs in this dream sequence? Yes. Because the first time we saw our sister hung. Alright. Only place 
place we can go is right over here. We're in a study. Book learning time. It's a nice change of pace from dolls. Oh, there's my sister. Hey, sis. How you doing? Ooh. Why would I do that? Why would I stab myself? Okay. And now we're in a padded cell, it looks like. Well, with that, all that excitement, it looks like we're... With all that excitement, it looks like we're going to stop this one right here. So, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.